Hey, it's Daniel Jacob from Everlasting Confidence, and in today's video, I'm gonna share with you the number one dating app that you should be using in 2023 to have massive success with women. And by the way, it is not what you think it is, so make sure to stay until the end of the video. So up until now, dating apps have been very popular, especially over the past 10, 15 years, right? And during COVID, you know, when people weren't socializing, weren't going out to bars and clubs and different events, everybody was using dating apps to connect, to text, to, to really get to know each other. So now things are a bit different, right? Number one, COVID's over. And number two, specifically for men, there has been a really big burnout with dating apps. And, and significantly, a lot of men are just massively, massively struggling. And the reason why they're struggling it's for a couple of reasons. Number one is that only really the top 10% of men are having success with most of the women. And that's because the top 10% of men have the best lifestyle, they're the most confident, they're the most physically attractive, they have the most resources to invest in getting you know, an incredible photographer. And it goes even further than that, right? It's not just about having high quality photos. It's about knowing how to text really well, knowing how to banter really well, um, knowing how to really build connections with women um, and hook them in using your bio, using the different images that you use and, and having a very curated profile. So the guys that have the best profile, the best texting skills are the guys that are having the most success. Everybody else is basically just getting nothing or they're kind of just picking up the crumbs. So that's number one is the competition is insane. Number two is that because women have so many options, they have dozens and dozens of guys every day that are hitting them up, they're having hundreds of matches every week, they don't feel the need to really pursue things with any specific guy if there's even something very, very, very subtle that they notice, right? So maybe there's one little thing in his picture that she doesn't like, or he maybe texts her something that she doesn't like, and women are just ghosting, right? Women are not invested because they're using a virtual platform. They've never met you in person. And there is just that, that flakiness that's happening. And that's causing guys to be really frustrated and really disappointed. Um, on top of that, there's a lack of trust. And the lack of trust is because she's never actually gotten to know you. She's never met you. She's never really felt your energy. She's never really felt your confidence, because that's ultimately what women are looking for, is a guy who emotionally makes them feel something. And if she's all she's seeing is just photos of you, sure, she could be a little bit curious and interested, but a lot of the time, due to that lack of trust, she's maybe agreeing to dates and not showing up to the actual dates with you. And then finally, and this is really the worst, is the amount of scamming that's happening on dating apps for majority of men, is that a lot of the women they post photos that aren't actually what they look like, right? You match with a girl, you get really excited, and then either she shows up on the date and looks totally different, or another example of this is that the woman that you're talking to all of a sudden sends you um, a request to pay her money, right? For some sort of service, or she sends you her OnlyFans. Like I've had stuff like that happen to, to guys that I've worked with. And that's just really disappointing and very discouraging, especially when you've spent a lot of time and energy into getting to know this person and you've had all these expectations built up. So if apps like Tinder and Bumble and Hinge aren't really you know, the best option right now, they're not the most effective way to meet women, what do you do? What is the best dating app? And that is Instagram. And the reason why I say Instagram is the best dating app is because Instagram, number one, allows you to tell a story, right? It allows you to show not only your personality, it allows you to show your lifestyle, it allows you to, through stories, right, that's one of the features on Instagram, to show the different things that you're doing. It also allows you to send voice notes. And that is very, very important because you're able to kind of communicate with women um, in a more natural way. You're able to FaceTime them directly through Instagram. You're able to get a deeper look into their life, right? Because Instagram tells a lot where with dating apps, you only have a couple photos. So those are all some really good reasons, but an even bigger reason is because I see Instagram as a funnel to bring new women into your life 
um, and to really get them to get comfortable with you over time, right? Because with a dating app, she matches with you and then she forgets about you. But with Instagram is that you add a girl maybe a year ago and maybe at that time you guys connected, she was not in the place to kind of date you. Um, maybe you had something going on, but as she watches your stories, as she sees your posts, you guys almost build attraction with each other over time. She becomes more invested in you over time. She's almost like watching you as a, as a character in a movie. Um, and she's, she's getting to know you. She's building that trust with you. And then when you decide to meet up with her later in person, maybe you want to ask her out, you want to invite her to an event, she's way more likely to actually hang out with you. So the way that I see Instagram is almost like a social resume. Right now in 2023, um, doesn't matter if you're living in Europe, doesn't matter if you're living in Asia, doesn't matter if you're living in South America or in the United States, like we're here in Miami, Instagram is a universal language that is used by all women. All women that especially are very attractive, very desirable, are all on Instagram and they're all going to check your Instagram, right? And if they meet you in person or they meet you through friends or they meet you at a club and they look at your Instagram and your Instagram isn't a world that she wants to come into, she is not going to be receptive to you, right? So Instagram right now, you could think, okay, this is vain, this is superficial, but this is just the reality of 2023. Everybody has an Instagram. It is literally like a resume that you send out when you wanna get hired for a job. So part of what we do in our accelerator program is that we help you build your Instagram. We help you build a high value, attractive Instagram that is also authentic to you, that really illustrates the type of person you're at. You are and in, in really allows you to have this this social resume, as I said, that that really invites women to come into your world. So if you want to learn more about our accelerator program, tap the link below, apply. We only work with guys that are successful, that are high performers, whether they're entrepreneurs or male professionals, and they're really committed to having the best dating life that they possibly can, having the dating life of the top 10 or even 5% of men in the world. So thank you and I'll see you in the next video.